how to come. Um, I applied for a job in Atlantic City. Fortunately, I knew uh, the superintendent, Dr. Jack Eisenstein, uh, was good friends with my uncle, to be quite frank with you. I got a job here as a, as a teacher, and I taught for 15 years. I've been the athletic director for 26 years. Well, the most memorable things have been uh, just to see so many of our student athletes that have become productive uh, citizens. Uh, not necessarily superstars, although we've had a lot of great athletes here, but they've uh, become doctors, lawyers, uh, radio personalities, police officers, firemen. I mean, the list is endless. And that's what's, that's what's very meaningful to me because their participation in athletics, I believe, helped them to become productive citizens. One of my favorite sayings is 10 years of experience can be something re repeated 10 times. Uh, every year Atlantic City High School, and especially in athletics, is something unique. I learned something new. Um, in retirement, I think everybody, this, everybody always thinks about a couple of subject areas, which I'm not going to get into right now, about a book, to tell you the truth. But I like to do something, uh, it, it could be anything, work, for, try to get a, help out the Red Cross or Salvation Army. Uh, and there's so many things that I, I like to, because I'm, I'm an active person. I, my favorite sports have always been high school sports and, and the collegiate sports. Uh, I don't really follow that, that many uh, uh, professional sports. You know, I'll go to a Phillies game and I'll go to an Eagles game, but I don't really follow them like a lot of people do. I'm more into the high school sports and the collegiate level sports. I'll definitely come, be coming back to Atlantic City High School. Um, you know, it means a lot to me. The most I'll probably miss will be the interactions I've had with a lot of coaches administrators, um, and uh, just seeing like today, Lavander Jones, who just graduated from James Madison University, we played football there. He came in here, we were talking for a half hour. Uh, th those are things that I'll miss, not running into a lot of the, uh, the, the alumni of Atlantic City High School. And, and I've also had the chance to meet people on some of the committees or outstanding individuals like Leo Schofer, um, an outstanding person. A, uh, uh, and uh, uh, I'm going to miss things like that because he's on the president of Alangsi High School Hall of Fame committee. And there's a, a numerous, uh, you know, I mean, I hope to see these people more, but my interactions with them, like Ron Jordan, uh, Kenny Williams, although I, you know, I want to stay in contact, but when you're involved with them on like committee levels, it's a little different. Um, had a, the opportunity to work with a lot of great administrators, I think, and the Atlantic City Board of Education has always been supportive of athletics. That's a good thing. Uh, I, they know the value of sports for inner city youth, and um, that's helped, helped me maintain this length of time that I have in my tenure.